it say long road ahead? Yeah. Uh, oh, Ethan's slick. Look at this guy. Nice hair, pal. Yeah. Jeez. Oh, now I'm playing his son. Yes. Oh, you're the king now. I rule. He hides too well, and if he was smart, he would reveal himself. Now get out of here, Lee. Game anymore. Maybe something happened to him. Ethan's fine. Oh, yeah, He's I would just forgotten to. this is a game. I win. Congratulations, your lordship. Oh. It's no way to talk to your lord. Oh. Just a game, Ryan. No way to touch your lord either. <laughs> he was worried you were gone. I thought we'd never find you again. These kids need discipline. Yeah. <laughs> we gotta treat Ethan as if he's Joffrey. Like that's how his decisions. Yeah. Okay. Should go. Ethan's the new Joffrey. <laughs> so yeah. we're just gonna be a dick to everybody. Yeah. Well, not necessarily. Joffrey wasn't a dick to everyone. Uh, like people. Kind of. Uh, yeah, he was. Yeah, Except his mom, maybe. Even then, still a bit of an asshole. I don't want Gareth to die either. Maester Ortengrin said he got sent to the wall. It's the safest place. Garrett. How do we want to compliment ourselves? He is smart. We're, we're complimenting Garrett. Yeah, not ourselves. That's, that's, that's Garrett. That's us. No, it's not. Garrett's Garrett. We're freaking with Garrett Ethan right did, now. It must have been serious. Jeez, Christian. Duncan and Sir Royland talking. They said someone will come here looking for revenge. Everyone's worried about you, but I'm not. I know you'll protect us. <laughs> Who said they're worried about me? Well, Sir Royland for one. He says you can't fight very well. What? Oh. And he calls you a milksop. <laughs> Shit, not a milksop. So I'll have him punished. He forgets himself. I'll have him punished for saying that. What does milksop mean? I don't know, but I know it's not good. Ethan, you should let Sir Royland teach you how to wield a sword. Like, like a man. Oh. I'm just a boy! He taught Roderick and Asher, and he even showed me how to fight. Properly, I mean. A lord should know how to fight. No, I refuse to learn how to fight. <laughs> we'll just beat people down with our words. Mm -hmm. Just get everyone else to fight for you. You, me, Roderick, Asher. Could all be Asher must be hours. their second, yeah. second son. Where was I? Who probably died. Born yet. We had so much fun. But then, well, then everything changed. Roderick became so serious. The Lord the in training. training. And he never smiled anymore. And Asher, Asher just got angry at everything. <laughs> Promise me you won't be like that. Oh, oh she not. called us out. No, she called us out. No, We're not going to be like that. The way you are. Nah. No. No, wait. I don't want things to change. I don't want I may to change. Have to change. I, we don't want no, to, but we have to. to. No, I don't want to yet. No, no, we're not going to now. She just called us out. She no, just no, called no. our bluff. No, we can't. Don't change. We're not nice anymore. No, don't change. She called us out. She called her ploy. You can't just change now. But I want to be Joffrey. He dies. We don't want that. Hmm. I don't care about Ethan, I care more about Jared. It would be nice if Yo, give him all the sweets he wants. Be as many as he'd like. Ethan will be a good lord. Okay. A proper lord. As many as you'd like, yes. <laughs> 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 See, he remembers. <laughs> yeah, you gotta play both sides. <laughs> See you guys. I'm assuming she's the older sister. Why can't she be What's the head of the house? She's a woman. Yeah, she's a woman. But isn't Amelia Clark, whatever, isn't she the head of whatever? She's the head of absolutely nothing right now. Other than the freaking... Well, uh, actually, that's because her brother, brother is dead, actually. He's demanding an audience with the Lord. We really must go. No, take a hike. Oh, wait. Oh. Remind him who's Lord. How yeah. command Ethan to stay with his family? I might remind you, Sir Royland. I'm the new Lord of House Forrester, not you. Oh. Of course, man. It's okay. You should go. It's what must be done. Don't go. No, I'll do it. Do it. Fine. Let's be done Ugh, with it. it must be done. Now he's pissed off at us for nothing. Like, we have to go. Yeah, yeah, but it had <laughs> to be done. We need to set the tone so he doesn't yeah. call us out. Hmm. She just constantly looks like she's going to tear up and cry. 
<laughs> it does. Look at her. Yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine yeah. living in this world as a woman? Mm. It'd be shit. You're literally just a hole. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> because we know what yeah. happened to that Garrett so guy, we need to we need to be a dick to this dude. To his uncle? Yeah, because yeah. he was a dick. He just sent off our friends. Just being an ass. Lord Whitehill knows Garrett is a squire to this house. Or was, I suppose. Is. Was. It makes no difference. The Whitehills were clearly in the wrong. So don't give him any satisfaction. Okay. Out there, you said you were the Lord. Now prove it. Shit. Let's not do something rash. Things are bad enough as it yeah. is. I can handle Lord Whitehill. Well said, my lord. Now is not the time to anger Lord Whitehill any more than he already <laughs> oh, is. Oh, off. Five times as many men, and the backing of House Bolton. All the more reason. We're gonna get everyone killed. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> the best possible option. Like our whole family's gonna get fucking murdered. Oh God. He's a sim. Squat. <laughs> I think it is. Yeah. Holy, it's fat. It's killing oh, them. Ethan, is it? My condolences for your father and brother. Say fuck you. Don't shake his hand. No, do it. Shake his hand. You gotta be no. Ignore shake his it. hand. Shake his hand. You don't be a dick right away. You can be a dick after. Oh, you're dumb. You're actually dumb. <laughs> We're gonna get slaughtered. No, father's this, dead. This is oh, stupid. Oh, he's bad. Oh. I've been waiting for this day all my life. Don't test me. Foresters finally. Oh, you guys are losers. I may be young. But I'm not so easily fooled. They're trying to rile me, but it won't work. Young, you are that boy. Too young to know when you're in over your head. And no bread and salt. What kind of fucking house receives a lord with no fucking bread and salt? You bloody amateur. No courtesies. I should have expected as much. Which one? Calm down. Bloody Nothing. Foresters. Calm yourself. Old man. Oh. You little fuck. That's how you talk to a lord. You foresters have shit on us for generations. Well, now the Starks are no longer around to have your back, are they? We're the power in the North now. Roose Bolton is the warden of the North. Aye. And we've been his bannermen for five fucking centuries. You cunt. <laughs> lord Ethan. You're losing control of this. That's, uh, Maybe if you had been so fucking greedy with the iron, oh, sure. things would have been different between us. You squandered your share. Our share was taken from us. We had no fucking choice but to harvest what was left. What is it you want, Lord Whitehill? So this guy's dead. Your man, the squire. We were minding our own business. Keeping the king's peace, as his lordship here said, when your man attacked us for no reason. He yeah. killed his family. Attack. Murdered his family. No reason. <laughs> no reason. You murdered his family. Then you admit it was your man who killed my men. And a pig farmer at that. How do you answer for your squire, Lord Ethan? He acted in your name. Mm. And hey, man. Yeah. Pretty much. He was defending his family as any man would. But your men murdered them all. You lost pig farmers, not soldiers. Soldiers worth a hundred of their type. Where's the fucking coward who killed my men? I know he's here. What have you done? We haven't seen him. him? Yeah. We haven't seen him. He was never here. You little liar. I will find him. By the gods, you better hope I do, because if I don't, I'm holding you responsible. And you'll answer for what he's done. I'm not leaving until I have my justice. Now bring me the coward who did it, or you'll answer to Roose Bolton. What kind of fucking house is this? <laughs> this guy. Lady Forrester. You bellow like a wounded boar, Lord Whitehill. Have you forgotten your manners? I mean no disrespect to you, my lady, considering your losses and all. This, this is not over. It's over when my son says it is. It's over. This is over, Lord Whitehill. Ethan is Lord of Ironrath now. By rights, his word is law here. If that displeases you, then I trust you can find the door. Oh. 
This family's full of sass. Mm -hmm. Maybe lord of this house. But lord Bolton will have the final say. I'll send him a raven letting him know a forester man killed one of his own. That the new Lord Forester lied to my face and denied me my justice. Then we'll see whose word is law. Do as you like. Mm -hmm. Do as you like, Lord Whitehill. <laughs> He'll remember that. Sure, cool. Fine. Why can't we just murder them all? Because you're a kid. Yeah. Why can't my pikemen just run in behind them and like kebab Lord them? Bolton will come in with his army and ruin your life. Yeah. He stood up to him like a true lord. You were brave, my son, but you'll need to be braver still when oh, the shit. Likes to see you bend the knee. He's coming. Prepare He's gonna fucking torture us now. In King's oh. Oh, uh, Who cares about you, Thunley? I'm assuming it's gonna change characters again. Yeah. Oh, King's Landing. Your sister can help us. Oh, we're gonna be the sister now. Although just a handmaiden, she has Marjorie Tyrell's favor. And Lady Marjorie's right. betrothal to the King may be enough to keep the Boltons at bay. If it's presented to her as it should be. Jump. Might as well. Do a flip. I wonder if it's sunny at all. Yeah. <laughs> Is there anything else? No. Well, actually, I, know, I think I could have taken the letter, but I didn't. I don't think we should. I don't know anything. Yeah, probably. Well, then I'll know that you're spying. Oh, I didn't read it. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, I thought you did. Much excitement here in King's Landing for the coming wedding. Lady Marjorie has proven to be quite popular throughout the city. I do wish you and mother could come, although I know it would be impossible under the circumstances. I miss all of you, and I look forward to the day you can. Why she seems so sad? I thought she was spying on someone. Nah, who knows? Oh. Oh, maybe read that. <laughs> what? Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> it troubles Church me to teleport. ask this of you, but you must appeal to Lady Marjorie to intervene on our behalf. She is our best hope, and can be a powerful ally, especially now when your family so desperately needs her help. So who's Lady Marjorie? Natalie Dormer. Mm. Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are we gonna see That's her? Yeah, hopefully. Let's be nice to Natalie Dormer. That's not her at all. Maybe we'll get to sleep with her. One moment. Oh, sorry, my lady. Push him out the window. Do you mean? No, no, let him in. Send him away. No, he's a he's, he's a little kid. Yeah. <laughs> Come in. You know. Also, why did he have such a deep voice? He sounded like. Or he look. He's gonna fucking attack you now. Yeah, it is what it is. What's he doing? Cool. Starting a fire. <laughs> Begging your pardon, my lady, but you are right. If you don't mind my asking, you I'm seem fine. rather upset. I'm fine, thank you. Of course, my lady. Is this the chick that was sleeping with her brother in the TV show? Lady Marjorie will be here any minute. Um, you said push him out the window. That's Cersei. That's the queen. Um, this is Cersei? No, the queen is the one that oh. sleeps with her brother. Or she slept. Uh, I'm maybe not. But it seems like you do. I don't even know what he said. It's widely known that I work for Lady Marjorie. I've seen you with her before. You seem like good friends. I saw Lady Marjorie just this morning, outside the Royal Seps, talking to Queen Cersei. Cersei? They appeared to be having some sort of disagreement. I couldn't hear much, but what did this guy know? What did they say? It was definitely an argument. What did they say? I couldn't make out much, but I know they were talking about the Starks and, and House Forrester. House Forrester? I hope you're not in any kind of trouble. But I thought you ought to know. Most people okay. don't tend to notice a cowboy. Not in King's Landing with so many lords and ladies about. 
You see and hear all sorts of things when people don't even know you're there. Oh, poor guy. No, that'd be you back in the day. The cool boy. Yeah. The cotton boy. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. The cotton boy. Oh, oh, there she is. Hey, baby. Audrey, Looks right? just like her. I was hoping there would be time for us to talk. This here. Come. There's something we must discuss. I like how you can actually tell it's her, though. Yeah. So where are the sex scenes at? From the day you arrived in High Garden, I've thought of you more as a friend than as my handmaiden. A dear friend, in fact. Thank you, my lady. And you know how I feel about what's happened to your family. I feel your pain as if it were my own. What you've suffered is beyond imagining. I need your help. And your whole family mm -hmm. as well. I need your help, my lady. Of course. And I will help you in any way I can. But there's another matter we must attend to first. She always grabs people's arm you must like understand that. In the show as well. To what yeah. I can say, especially here in King's Landing, now that I am to be queen. To have a handmaiden from the north whose family fought for Rob Stark. It raises questions at a time I can least afford. Cersei herself cornered me this morning outside the royal set. She mentioned the northern girl in my service, and she painted you a traitor. She was very pleased with herself. I'm a traitor. Her face was full of mirth as she said it. I'm not a traitor. Of course not. It's only an excuse to torment you, and by extension, mm. me. Is she actually a traitor, though? She I demands feel like an audience. Well, she wants an apology. Um, are we like a spy? She's spying right now, but she's waiting for us now, and I promise. It's kind of because her family pissed off everyone right now. I cannot afford any conflict with Cersei if the wedding is so far. near. Well, they Who pissed off the lady? like Cersei. I knew I could trust Wait, what? You. Why? Because the mother. Starks. You Tell know how Starks all just got fucking murdered. Sure. Well, Ned Stark said was the one who said that Cersei was sleeping with her brother and that Joffrey wasn't the true king. Oh. So that's why everyone in King's Landing hates her family. Because they were with the Starks. Oh. Is that supposed to be the mountain? Before I almost fell asleep. I know you You may feel one thing, but you must say another. <laughs> I want more, like, sword fighting. That was a fun part. Good luck. Is that the midget? Mm. The dwarf? You yeah. can do this. The imp? That's <laughs> what they call him. <laughs> I thought his throne was supposed to be massive. It is. Do you see it? In like the books, though, it's supposed to be like as tall ah, as the Lady building. Marjorie, aren't you looking mm. lovely this evening? Close. You're in a sword. To him, it looks like it's as tall as the building. Yeah, exactly. A normal size chair. With your permission, allow me to introduce Lady Mira of House Forrester. Neil. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta be nice to the queen, mm -hmm. cause she's a bitch. She'll ruin your life. She will. This is Cersei. Yeah. Girl knows her courtesies. Impressive. You may ride. Plus, she thinks you're a traitor right now. So. Yeah. <laughs> house Forrester is a northern house loyal to the king. Are they? I beg your pardon, your grace. I wasn't talking to you. I want to hear from the girl. No, oh, she's a bitch. Is yeah. your family loyal to the king? Yeah. Perhaps you should ask the new Lord Forrester. He's not here. Is there King Joffrey? She is. Yep. Mm -hmm. Joffrey is the one true king, Your Grace. Hmm. You have to lie. And yet, for centuries the foresters have been loyal bannermen to House Stark, a house of traitors. Uh, they were our wardens. They were the wardens of the North. We all served at the pleasure of the king. Clever girl. Clever for her own good. 
Uh. The girl did name Joffrey as the one true king. Is your house Are those two together? Cersei and your new liege no. lord, Bruce no. Bolton. No. He also served the Starks. Bruce Bolton also served the Starks. Oh, she got Sam Fisher off. And proved his loyalty to the crown by bringing their house to a swift and sudden end. He just Old allegiances are not easily abandoned. But now that the war is over, we must look to rebuild and forge new alliances. There are ships and shields to be built, and Joffrey will need a steady supply of ironwood for his armies. I'm told there are others who would happily serve that purpose, but I trust we can rely on House Forrester. Forrester Ironwood does seem rather... To say yes. Yes, Your Grace. It would be a shame to see it fall into the hands of another house. I imagine you'd do almost anything to prevent that from happening, wouldn't you? Ask any Lannister, and they'd do whatever was necessary to save Casterly Rock. It would be unfortunate to see another house lay claim to Lord's Force. Uh, yes, sure. I would do anything. Yeah, you can always fuck her over later. <laughs> I, I went though because, like, that's, that's not a good call. Girl do, she'll be queen and she'll ruin your life. Fought beside mm -hmm. the star, sure. wielding a battle axe with the northern army. <laughs> she always looks so mad. This is an interesting question, I suppose. Can we truly blame those who end Tyrion up seems really, like, sassy. Our dear Marjorie yeah, but let's just do what it is. ...to Rene Baratheon on the false assumption that he would one day rule the Seven Kingdoms. Can we fault her for her mistake? Should she be held accountable? I won't judge her. She only followed her heart. Yeah. I'm she was just following her heart, your grace. And the very same heart so quickly led her to my son. If there's a point to this, I hope you find it quickly. Loyalty can be such a hard thing to define. This city alone is filled with all sorts of ambitious She's opportunists pissed. looking to reinvent themselves. So in other words, we're going to probably get beheaded as soon as we walk out. No. She's going to be a bitch to us all the time. You are a girl from the north here in service to Lady Marjorie. One can only assume her interests are yours. Yet loyalty to a king be absolute beyond question and if your loyalties were to become conflicted between your king and the very person whom you serve what would you do then i'm sure Let she the would the girl answer the question mm, you would be Go conflicted on. i guess my loyalties would never conflict your grace that's a coward your grace answer. i will not have my time <laughs> a northern girl who thinks she can play games Man. who would you choose no give me all the wrong answers Every thing I tell her, she just gets pissed. Oh god. Mm. You're gonna have to say my king if you wanna please her. Go the king, yeah. The king, of course. Well said. Now Marjorie's pissed, damn. Worry, but we had you. Cersei, Cersei has the potential to ruin everyone's life that we've ever known. But now, what if Marjorie doesn't help us? And no, we don't get to see her naked. <laughs> we're not dead. Yeah, at least we don't die. My sense is this girl yeah, now we don't get to sleep in my yeah. God damn it. We were that close, mm -hmm. Shane. This isn't we ruined it. This isn't the dude that got sent to the wall. Or Ethan. I'd like a word with you. But this is the closest we get to Natalie Dormer. Of course, your grace. <laughs> he knows what's up, he's upset. I'll walk you out. Oh thanks, man. This may come as a surprise, but I met your father once, at the tourney at Lannisport. Even then he didn't trust Bruce Bolton. We only spoke briefly, but your father struck me as an honorable man. You have my condolences for his loss. Oh, so she doesn't know. Say the Boltons have no honor. Yeah. Time, or well, my family is in the Forgive me for saying it, but the Boltons have no honor. Bruce Bolton has many unique qualities. Tyrion's nice, Honor so he's not one of them. Mm -hmm. Understand. That certainly took courage. How has he lived this long, though? So I thought nice people died in this. Because he's, he's witty. He's smart. Like, like a master. <laughs> That's the main reason. It was quite the first impression. I, of course, found it all highly entertaining. I was tempting you. He's here. No doubt Lady Marjorie will forgive you. Eventually. Eventually. My sister and I 
have oh, they're defensive. Siblings? Yeah. She takes great Good. pleasure in the charades. She doesn't like the charades. Like mine mine siblings. siblings. We must find our amusements where Quote unquote siblings? <laughs> they are. Well, like, as in Jon Snow is a sibling. To, to it is the master of the Starks, but he isn't. Tyrion. There's rumors. He's a He's dragon a rider. Tyrion is a sibling. But he might not be. Not her. What? You can help my family. Because he can control dragons. He can ride a dragon. I suppose the crowd He's a Targaryen. Be persuaded to secure yeah, I could ride a dragon too. I wish no. how to train your dragon. That's a great movie though. Favorably on such a no, just kidding, actually. Yeah. It would infuriate Cersei. Although what would be amusing for me might prove rather dangerous for you and your house. Are you willing to risk that? Yeah. Yeah. It's a risk I'm willing to take, Lord Tyrion. Please. You are a brave girl, aren't you? I'll consider it. Ah, we what did it. Gem. If you'll excuse me, I promised Sansa I would join her for dinner tonight. Three beautiful bottles of Dornish wine await my arrival. The mere thought of them I makes hope me thirsty already. I hope we meet again. Nothing would make Cersei happier. Until then, be careful. This is not the North. King's Landing can be a nest of vipers to the uninitiated. <laughs> Thanks, man. He's got swagger. Because he he's a hobbit. 